Hey folks, Natalia here. In this video, I will tell you about how I actually made my final decision to change my life and quit my job. Um, I actually got super lucky. I was sent on a secondment to Dublin for four months and it was a really fortunate thing to do. So if you're contemplating a change and you're struggling to make that decision, maybe changing kind of the scenery might facilitate and serve as a catalyst for you making that decision. The reason it helps is because when you remove yourself from the day-to-day -day environment, you actually get to th see things differently and you can almost start experimenting with some of the hypotheses that you already have. So when I was in Dublin, I... First of all, I was just reading a lot. I found a few really relevant books in a office library. I um, I read uh, so many of them. Um, a Job to Love or How to Find a Fulfilling Career from the School of Life, just to name a couple. And I was doing lots of and lots of exercises just to kind of figure things out. And at some point, what happened it's literally how they describe in books, which I thought was never possible and over romanticizing it. But actually what happened is that that was one of those sleepless nights and I just, I just couldn't fall asleep. And this decision sort of just dawned on me at some point. It, it just dawned on me and I, it became crystal clear. I, I knew that's it. I, I knew that I need to change my life. I knew that. I must quit my job. I must do something else. I didn't know what, what I will be doing. I had no idea, but I knew that I'm doing it. And that was it. That was kind of drawing that line for me. But I think it, well, it didn't happen overnight. I mean, it did happen overnight. But um, in my previous video, I talked about how I almost quit my job a year ago. And then the fear crept in and then I didn't. So those things take time. And you might go, you might uh, come in a few circles and before you actually make the final decision and that's fine. You sort of need to absorb a lot of information and a lot of stimulus and maybe talk to a lot of people to, to, to almost be, get ready to make that decision. And so when that happened, I spent the rest of the summer figuring out the details because once the decision was made and that's it I'm doing it, I still had to figure out what exactly am I doing <laughs> and that's where I um, again did a lot of different exercises and uh, invented a lot of different exercises uh, which eventually um, became the foundation for my life strategy methodology with which um, which I'm I've launched on Life Startup um, website and you can uh, check out the steps and you can even sign up and do it with us but when I was um, figuring things out there were a lot of things I really had to work through it was a lot of fears that I had to address it was a lot of practical things that I needed to think about like what to do with my stuff or where my address will be and I will talk about all those things in the next videos but it certainly wasn't an easy one and I was super lucky because Dublin summers are not the most sunny ones and I didn't have any feelings of FOMO for staying in and being a bookworm for that for those few months um, instead it actually really helped me figure everything out so by the time I finished my secondment uh, it was so I, I went there in May and then I finished in August when I returned back to London that was it so I handed in my notice and I only had a, a few weeks to to pack things up and um, and move so that's how I made that decision don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like us on our Facebook